Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap. Today's Monday, December 28th. Unfortunately, starting the week out on a red note and a pretty decent sized red red day at that. Uh, minus 26.27 for the day. Uh, I just did one runner. Start with the start with the positives. Did one runner uh, in Disney. Booked a $708 profit there, so that was good. No pairs trades, but the mighty 90. A uh, couple positions in particular got us Facebook. Took a loss of 811, and then Amazon was our big loser at minus 2875. Uh, caught a small winner in Apple, scratch for 32 bucks. Baba, nice winner for plus 444. Basically, a little scratch in Microsoft. Nice winner in Netflix, uh, and a couple of losers in Nvidia and Piton. But Amazon and Facebook were the culprits. And I'll show you a couple of things that I could have done differently in hindsight. Of course, we always talk about you know don't don't try to trade in hindsight because you've got to determine the trade and the factors within at the time of the trading, which obviously is real time. And that's the, that's what really matters. So let's start with Amazon. Let me go through this. First of all, uh, had this little flush lower in the morning and we got long right here. So I did catch a little bounce there. So that was a, that was a profitable trade. But when this thing exploded higher, uh, we started getting short right here on this big volume spike. Uh, and then we added a little here and then and then this thing just kept ripping higher. It never gave us, uh, you know, more than one little red bar here and one little red bar here. So never really gave us a chance to get out. Now, one thing we teach in our class about Mighty 90s is after you get past 10 a.m. Central or specifically, you know, 1030 at the latest, one way to really defend against these runners that keep going is to just close out your trade if if you're not if you're still in it by those times so that's one thing that i could have done differently i could have closed out now you know nine times out of ten you, you will get a little bit of a reversal and that's what i was looking for but it never did happen so anyway we ended up holding through all this uh so ended up taking a sizable loss in amazon i did stay super small i mean i was just doing one contract on these on when i was scaling in so did you know amazon is big so it's hard to stay small in air quotes, but uh, but well within my range of of capacity of, of what I'm willing to trade and what I'm willing to risk. My only in hindsight, my only thing that I wish I would have done different on this was closed it out early instead of letting this thing run later in the morning. But that is uh, that's what happened. And then similar in, in Facebook, we got short uh, right here and then added right here and we were profitable during this chop. Uh, and, and same thing here. I think the one thing I wish I would have done was just, you know, it was past 10 o'clock here. I could have got out for a tiny profit to a scratch. Instead, I let this thing run against me thinking we would get a, a little bit of a reversal. Never did. Uh, so ended up getting out at this point here and taking a loss in Facebook. Uh, in Apple, which was a small winner, uh, had this big push up and we got short here. When we got this flush, we closed out a sum for profit. When it started to rally, we just closed out the rest because it looked like it was going to push higher. It did end up coming down for us and, and pushing up later, but we uh, still booked a little profit, basically a scratch, 32 bucks on that one. Uh, Baba was our biggest winner, plus 444 today uh, on this big push up. We got short here and caught some downside, some of that downside action there in Baba. Uh, Microsoft was a, a small winner as well uh, on this big push up in, oh wait, so no, no, no. In Microsoft, uh, we actually, it was the long trade here. Uh, we got we got long right here, caught that bounce, uh, part of this bounce, and then we did get short, but we just we got chopped up and, and cut out of a basically a scratch there. So net net plus forty eight dollars in Microsoft. Uh, Netflix had a winner in Netflix on this flush lower. We got long and caught this little bounce here for plus two forty five. Nvidia minus 230, kind of similar, uh, same time frame as Netflix. Uh, this one kept pushing against us, pushing against us. We did get a bounce, uh, but by that time it was it was below where we below where we started getting long. So it took a took a little loss in Nvidia, and then lastly in Piton. So Piton, we we got long here. We were, we had a nice profit on this bounce. We were looking for a little bit more, and then this thing just rolled over. So we ended up closing out of the rest of it uh, after it flushed lower. So took a small loss on Piton of 188. So red day to start the week, not how I like to do it. We got our, we got our work cut out for us the rest of this week, uh, but we will be streaming live uh, the rest of this week in our Discord. So look forward to seeing you then. If you guys have any questions, let me know.